Hello YouTubers, this is Cessna Ace, and I thought I would go over the procedure for requesting a game at highscore.com. If you go to enter in the sc a score for that game, and you find that it's not there. It's hard to do, looking through the camera. I'll just pick one that's already there. Or more one. If I don't find what I'm looking for, I click on that. Then in here, I type whatever game it is that I'm requesting. Here's the pull down menu for all of the uh, systems that are covered currently in the database. You'll notice a lot of really old consoles as well as new plus you'll notice that we have a lot of microcomputers from back in the day. Japanese, British, and American. Plug and play also. Let's say it's for a console or a system that's not in the system. Click Other. And then for, say, currently we don't have the switch in the system. I don't know why, but if it's for the switch, you would type in the name of the game, there, the name of the system there, Switch. And how does the game score? Points highest, lowest. Shortest time, longest time, other. Click other and see what happens. Okay, we'll say highest points. Are there any specific difficulty settings? If there are, you would click yes and these are the ones that I commonly enter in when I make a request I request a lot of homebrews for example expert type A and then click submit request and then you're done however once you've done that, you need to go to your requests. These are my submitted requests. I really want Super Cobra Arcade, which is a homebrew added, and Mappy, and Space Game. Failsafe is in the system, but not all of the difficulty settings are, so there's that. And a new table for Sakurai Pinball has just been released. So what you do is, let's pick one. You'll need to add hyperlinks to show that what you are requesting actually exists. You could do a store page for like Steam or Atari Age, a YouTube Play Video, that, and a list of, say, homebrews, in this case, from Wikipedia. You leave the comment and then you are done. It's all pretty easy and straightforward.
Now, someone was wanting to do a review of my channel, well, not my channel, but my uh, high score homepage. The trouble is, they couldn't see my trophy case. As I then discovered from another user, once you hit the level of black belt or higher, your trophy case becomes invisible to all but you. As you can see, I've made Master, which leaves just one level left, Grand Master. And I am working towards that. I usually submit scores to be voted on every day. Anyway, this is a short video to cover all of that. Until next time, stay awesome.